there's a warrant for your arrest. Okay. Oh my God. I need to tell my boss. I'm not telling my boss. I work for the federal government myself. What the f is going on? I can't fucking go to jail, Mom. Hey, Jake, I have to log off. I have a family emergency. On March 27th of 2024, an adult female was arrested for filing unemployment benefits during the COVID-19 outbreak. She allegedly managed to get hold of over $19,000 from the federal government. She went in for an interview and stated she did not apply for benefits. Detectives soon find out that was false, and the woman wasn't heard from until three years later. Detectives show up to her front door with her family present. We got two coming at the door. The guide looks like he just ran over and grabbed a dog. Um, what's going on? Are you we have a couple people here. Okay, yeah. what's the inquiry? I'm not the residential owner. Is something going on? Is, are you Destiny? Uh, no ma'am. Okay, can I speak with Destiny, please? Can I speak with Destiny? Can I ask for this regarding? Can I ask for this regarding, please? Are, are you Destiny? Can I inquire, like, what it's for and then I can make a consensus? Do you mind? I'm asking you if you're Destiny. Are you Destiny? No ma'am. Okay, is Destiny here? No ma'am. Huh? Yeah, you're, you're Destiny, right? Would you mind if I just made a quick phone call? A phone call to who? Listen, we just want to talk to you real quick. It's kind of weird when you're holding the door like... Crack, well, like, because they have the dogs and I just well, don't want to... Asking, I don't want to get bit by a dog. That's why just my comfort you. and like my... Just for my own... I, my own... I can hang out out here. We can hang out out here. She just wants to talk to you. Okay, would you mind just for my own comfort and like this is not my home? And I could step out for you all? It's and just what? odd that on a, on a Wednesday that this is happening and you don't know what's going on. Well, right. No, I get it. I understand. Okay, I'm not, we're not here for the homeowner. I'm here to speak with you. So if you can step out for a second and we'll explain to you what the situation is. Um, just for my own safety, like, like you don't have a warrant or anything like that? I need you to answer me first. Are you Dustin Harris? No, ma'am. Okay, I don't. I don't believe what you're telling me. I know that you're listening, so I'm asking you to come outside for a second and speak with us. Okay. Uh, could you just give me one second, please? To grab my telephone, it's right now the table. Can you leave the door open while you grab it? You can come and make the phone call out of here. We'll let you make the phone call, but we do have to talk. If you leave the door open, we'll let you grab your phone. You can okay. make the phone call out here. Is that okay? I'm comfortable with that. Is she okay? Are you okay yeah. with that? Yeah. Okay. Can, can we leave the door yeah, open? Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Do you mind if I just put the... Sure. Okay. The dog, the gate, so the dog can't get out? Well, they have Daisy, another dog, so okay. we'll just put her back here. Okay. I'm going to Trader Joe's and I'm going to Miss Kim Lee. Yes. Oh, Kim Lee? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Detective Lee. Mm -hmm. Oh, detective? Oh, detective. Yes, there's, there's, they're all detectives. I think they're all detectives. I can't see. What is going on? I have no okay, so there's a warrant for your arrest. Okay. Oh my gosh. So that's what that's what we're here for. So oh, okay. I would like to explain more to you and actually sit down and have a conversation with you. Um, but in the meantime, we do need to take you back with us. And because you have your mom on the phone, that's why I'm explaining this to you. Mm -hmm. Um, so that she knows what's going on also. Okay? Okay. All right. Um, she won't tell you what the warrant's for? It's for uh, fraud. It's for what? It's for fraud, but like I said, we'll go well, back and, and sit down and actually I'll tell you, I'll let you... Yeah, please. Ex I'll explain all the charges exactly. Okay. But just because you have her on the phone, that's the only reason why I'm no, explaining. No, I understand. She, that's fine. As much as I am right now. My mom, that's fine. Okay, um, can you give your phone to, um, somebody, and then I'm gonna call Jaquette, and then I'll call, uh, I'll call, uh, Vinny, I mean, not Vinny, um, uh, Gary right now, to see if you get details from my phone. Um, okay, I'm, I'm in the middle, I need to tell my boss, I'm not telling my boss that, obviously. Can she, can she tell her boss that, like, I work for the federal government myself, so I, there's, for me, for my job security and my children. Are you working right now? Yeah, I'm in, I'm in a meeting, like, right now. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna 
give you that courtesy and we don't normally I know do, you that. Don't have to do that. So I'm go sure. ahead and make a phone call to your boss and let him know that you're gonna be, I guess, out for the rest of the day at least. Let me call you What the f is going on? Do you have all the context for like what's when going on or like what's when you the sit can I close the door because I don't want my yeah. children yeah. to hear that? Yeah. Is anyone else here adult-wise? Yeah. Um, yeah they are. Dad, dad, dad is here. Okay. Dad, dad, dad is here. Okay. Just because we don't obviously want to leave the kids. Oh, yeah. That's, that's so crazy. What's far for what? I have no idea. I have no idea. I don't know. I thought it, I thought it was for something for her. Like your cat, what he's handling with the ticket that I took yeah. care of for the Deerfield Beach Courthouse. I thought that's what it was for, but I'm like, there's no way because I'm not scheduled to go back to that hearing until May 9th. All right, let me let me call your kid. Um, I'm gonna go here with you. I'm gonna see which one is better, um, and then I'll call Gary to see what's going on. I don't know how long I'm gonna be here. She'll be able to. Let me give her my phone number. Can you can you take her number? Do you have a pen? Yeah, I can. Let me have. Can I speak to Kim? You're on speaker. She can hear you oh. clearly. Hey, Kim. Hi. How you doing? Thanks Kim. for being. Thank you for doing this. Uh, thank you for giving me the information you didn't have to this on me. No problem. Let me know when you're ready for my number. Okay. Speak to anyone without your attorney. Understood. I understand that, Mom, but I don't. I mean, they're gonna arrest you, do I know that I can't go to jail, Mom. I understand. So, Destiny, you have to go. I don't know what's going on, but you can't fight it. Yeah, you'll get another charge. I know that I can't do that. I'm going to call the attorney. You have to go with them. I mean, Delray PD, those are good people, believe me. But you have to go with them. I'll call you. I'm going to call Gary to see what the charges are, and we'll go from there, okay? Just be calm, but you do not say anything until your attorney gets here. You are not to say not one thing. Do you understand? Yes, Mom, I understand. All right. Yeah, I know you're worried about your job. But did you tell your job you had to get off? Did you I just, text them? I just sent my boss a ping on Teams. Did you have your he... boss's number just in case I need to call her? Because I don't know. Well, you'll be able to call me. Don't worry. So let me, let me, if you want to text me while you're there in front of them, your boss's number or something, just in case. Mom, you cannot tell my VP that. I, I'm not going to tell her that. I'm, I'm sorry for that. Can you just tell them I'm tell them I'm sick. I haven't taken off any time in over a year. Just tell them I'm sick or in the hospital or something. Okay, so you've had a chance to reach out to the boss. I'm mess still messaging him right now. Okay, and then um, I'll have you leave your watch here so that you don't have to worry about that when we get there. Okay. And do you have any other jewelry or? Anything else that you want to leave here? Do you need to take your asthma pump? I don't know if you're allowed to have that in there, but... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to grab it. Is it an inhaler? Yeah. They'll let you yeah. have it. Okay, good. Thank you. The nurse just signs off on it. Thank you. Can I ask you, like, a ballpark question of how long do you think I'll be sitting in there? We don't know. That's the thing. If you're going to get through that. It is a woman. It could be near the, we don't know, but, but did the kids see the... Yes, the, mom, they saw them, so okay, they're not stupid. Okay. They know what's going on, and I'm sure they can hear me through the tell window Tyrell, over there. All right, tell Tyrell to bring them in the room. I already so put I already put them in the room, mom. Hold on, kids. But they know. They saw them at the door, and I told Chloe to move. <laughs> I'm All right, I need to call the attorney. Just go with them. You're, you're in good hands, Delray's good. Um, let me just call the attorney, okay? And then um, I'll reach out to Kim to see what's going on, and I'll call Gary to make sure you're good. Okay. You have no idea what it's for? Mom, I have no idea. I wouldn't be sitting here right now. I'm literally driving around and walking the streets and going to Trader Joe's as if I'm a free person. No, he doesn't know what's going on. I just told him to hurry up and put the dog away, and I, I stepped outside quickly. I didn't even I didn't tell him anything. He knows nothing. All right. All right. Well, let me call Gary. I'm gonna call Gary to see if he'll give me information. 
because he's over. He's over there. Okay, boss. Well, all right. Um, I need to tell you. All right. Okay. Yeah, 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 Okay, yeah, there's a warrant. So, um, obviously you got the kids and everything, and I'm gonna have her leave her stuff with you so that we, we don't have to. Y'all know I want you to be in there, like, to They, have, they have no idea, I asked. Yeah, we don't make that determination, so once she goes up to county, um, then What is that, what does that mean? So, yeah, when we take you, you we take you back to fine. our police Sorry. department, just for processing and to do paperwork, and right. then we'll take you up to county jail where they process it. Right. Uh -huh. Y'all had like the time where she was judging? I don't know. I guess it's California, it's gonna be fine. No, it's not. <laughs> it's gonna be fine. I need to call my boss mom after to go. And I need to tell the kids goodbye real quick. Because they've already been standing out here for a while. Hey Jake, I have to log off. I have a family emergency and I'll probably need UTO for the rest of the week. Okay. Ballpark. Well, Thank you. I have to go like right now so I can't even give you context but no, I'm logging out for the day and if you could just like put UTO in for me so that I can at least, you know, get paid and whatnot. Um, okay. But I, I have to step away like now. Okay. Right. Thank you. Can I just say bye to my kids? Yeah, I mean, we don't really want you to go back in. So, that's the only thing. God, I don't, I just don't, I don't want them to, I don't want that type of anxiety to sit with them. You want us to like step out and one of us stay with you and the kids can come out and you just yeah. tell them that you gotta come and talk to us at the station or something like that. Yeah. That way you don't have all four of us standing around when they come out and doesn't go through. Wait, 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 wait. 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 I'm good. Are you good with that? Yeah, I'm good with that. Okay. Thank you. Can you use your shirt, please? This is not getting the job done. <laughs> um, does the nose ring come out or no? No, it does right, not. Yeah, yeah. okay. Just make sure oh, you yeah, that one. Oh, yeah, this one earring. Which one was with the meat on the right? Yeah, right. I, I oh, call you bring your computer just, just close it. I, just, I, I called my boss and I told them, I said, I have a family emergency. I have to go. Yeah. No belts or anything in pockets no. or anything like Nothing. that. Um, <clears throat> I don't even know what to tell them. Just like, tell what do people do? <laughs> just tell them that you're coming back to talk to us this about something. For now. <sighs> I mean, it could be tonight, you know, I, I just don't know, I know. so I don't want to tell you One thing it's, it's going to be tomorrow understand. when it's tonight, I don't want to, you know. Yeah. <clears throat> it's not even like I can say, what oh, mommy has a work trip, because I travel for work right. sometimes, so like DC and stuff. Yeah, I did this just in this You have to leave this hair clip. If you can, yeah. Do you know his number or do you want him to write numbers down? You have you know my number by heart, I would hope. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello, how y'all doing? Y'all know the Love you, Dustin. <laughs> Okay. Going. Okay, going. I'm going to um, have to head out down there with them and talk about some stuff that's going on. So I'm going to go down there and talk about what's going on with me. Okay? There you go. Give me a kiss. Okay. Okay. Um, All right. Perfect. But I'm okay now.
mind parking here? That's, That's why I said corner. we can okay. go right between the cars over here because you're going to go in this car over here. The woman was charged with three counts of miscellaneous statements to obtain re-employment benefits. According to EDD, she will have to pay a 30% penalty in addition to the overpayment amount. The next charge is fraud swindle to obtain property under $20,000, which is punishable up to five years in prison if convicted. Let us know what you think in the comments. Um, we can go back to an interview. 